they eventually learned that, nah, we don't really need to eat everyone because... Um, it was because... You know, well, because it, the other less sentient animals are just as viable for food and a lot more less violent. Or rather, they don't gang up on you when you've... Rather, the other humans don't immediately rush over with the flaming torches and such. So, Sedge does actually show that. One, two, three, four, five. We are going to take one or two hit. Just one hit, actually. This here, start marching them and actually wait. Aha! Sedge can't reach. Okay, let's do this thing. And a wagon, because I'd like to get this ranger out in the open sometime soon. I guess we'll have to make you a soldier. Who is it? Start advancing. What is still the right view? Oh boy, this one is actually kind of tense. And of course... I mean, it's good strategy, I can admit. what you're planning there. But here, we start making our move. wasn't enough. Oh my, that stings. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we can hang out just out of range.
might start pushing back hard here. Yep, catapult. That stings. Uh huh. I miscounted something fierce. this turn. Yeah, this works. Thirty on the special unit, so that's seventy. Forty-five, so we really can't afford to push him forward too far. God, to rush ahead. Right. They attack him. And you go after that because you're not very bright. that but I mean we might as well clear that out of the way
I want that trebuchet gone. Go away. And then, to be extra clever, we put a Pokemon here. And he can't do anything now. We might need to start retreating, actually. I don't think they can completely gang up on me, but they can certainly make, like... Hmm. Yeah, this is the time to retreat. Fortunately, there is a... this wagon is still here. So we can make an emergency retreat! Now after all this, I'm probably going to actually show the... Oh! Take out the trebuchet! Take out this barracks. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five! Yes! I can obliterate their barracks next turn. Move the puppy 
forward. Review forward. What do I want on the front lines? I have the money to burn. A spearman is good. Okay, Sedge is going to make cut a fine line through most of the people here. If he was smart, he'd have used that turn to make a... Yeah. If he was smart, he'd have used that turn to make a swordsman, but he chose to make a quagma instead. Yes! Obliterate! get a bonus. Park. Yeah, he's gonna regret this. Half health. Sedge might knock it down next turn, but... Now we start knocking chunks out of your health, thank you very much. One, two, three, four, five, six. So if he doesn't move, he's gonna get it. What sort of damage can you do to a tribute? 85%. One, two, three, four, five, six. So well, I think I want to take a bite out of him next turn, actually. Actually, wait. If I park the wagon here, one, two, three, four, five, he can't go into the trees. It's kind of 
Okay, you wanted to take that, huh? Arches get their shot in. Oh, he has his he has his groove ready. What's his groove do? Okay, Codex. Sedge. Sadistic rush. 35% the turn does not end. Okay, so he goes on a killing spree. And 35% damage, so it's going to keep... You just go out. Out, out, out. Still, 35% damage means that he's got to have some power ready. Right, it's only if they're weak enough that he can kill them. So he would be in killing range. Might as well just go full whole game to make some wagon barricades because <laughs> they seem tanky enough to do the job. Okay, I think we can do this. Heaven help me if I can't. It, oh, he wants to heal up, doesn't he? Ouch! Oh, that's unfortunate. He just got here too! Do 
One, two, three, four, five. And actually, I just realized... We can flatten this stronghold next turn. And if not flattened, then certainly give it a good thumping. So you just move back a titch. You can run back here and you take this one. Good puppy. Fear my wagon empire with its yak pool, <laughs> herb garden. <coughs> this is going to be a two part episode, I just realized by looking up at the thing, but okay. I can, I might as well kill what enemies I can. Although, to be fair, this is more just... Me knocking down a village. I mean, I could keep stalling out this battle, but this episode shouldn't go for any longer than it has. Finally, an end to this dark chapter. This saddens me, Sedge. After the opportunities I have given you, the trust I have placed in you. I believed we had made progress, but you shun redemption. I was a fool to believe you could change. 
Leave now, Sedge. You are no longer welcome in the Florin lands. Sedge is gone. But Greenfinger should watch the shadows. And so should Greenfinger's shiny cherry stone friends. That's not the last we've heard of him, I'll bet. C rank, but... Mm. You can now play as Greenfinger in the arcade. What fun. You have additional lore about Sedge. Handy. Actually, there's one thing I want to check before we quit for the episode. Um, Pick a commander, hunt for a mysterious weapon. So we can't use any of the Felheim troops yet. But we can use these three. Okay. I'm still not going to do it until I've absolutely beaten the campaign, but... Hmm. Well, anyway. Until next time, guys. Take care. I'll see you all around. And I also like this title screen because it sometimes has the troops chasing each other across the screen, but I don't know if we're going to see that. Oh, here we go. Yeah, anyway, thanks for listening. Take care, all. <laughs>